We're here at the Nokia booth and uh, we have an Android device right here. And who are you? Hey, my name is Marco. And uh, you're from HMD Global, right? That's correct, that's so, correct. So what is HMD Global doing? So HMD Global is uh, licensing uh, the Nokia brand and working together with a, a couple of partners, creating really, really cool uh, smartphones. So here, for instance, you have the, uh, the Nokia 6. I think it's very important to start a little bit uh, with, the, with the design of the product. We are starting with a, uh, a solid piece of aluminium and actually a CNC machine. We machine it for, for 55 minutes, we anodize it, we actually polish it, you see all these beautiful lines here, and it's a really, 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 really nice quality. The display, 5.5 inch, you have a sculpted um, uh, display, uh, Gorilla Glass. Uh, there's, there's almost no gaps in between anymore. Uh, not even a human hair can uh, uh, fit, in, uh, fit in between. The devices are shipping with uh, Android Nugget uh, 7.1. 7.11 to be uh, to be precise. And we are not adding uh, anything on top of the software, so there's no launchers, there's no bloatware or anything uh, uh, similar. Nice. So this enables us, uh, whenever Google is uh, bringing out new features, to give this to our consumers uh, relatively quickly. Also, we are committing uh, to monthly security updates, uh, which is nothing any of the uh, competitors um, are doing today. So inside this beautiful device, you'll find a Snapdragon 430 uh, processor. Uh, this device has uh, three gigabyte uh, RAM and 32 gigabyte of memory. There's another variant available, which is in a different color, a more premium color uh, in a polished design, uh, which comes with four slash 64 gigabyte uh, of memory. The devices are available in the second quarter of this year. Um, and this device starts shipping for 229 euros uh, retail retail price. So that's uh, the best value for that price, you think? Absolutely, absolutely. If you look at uh, uh, many of the uh, competitor devices, what you, for instance, see is that the uh, metal which is used, the sheet metal, which is uh, pressed in place. This one is really from a solid piece of metal. It's machined, so it's uh, really, 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 really high quality. Nice. Uh, so that's the six. What do you that's, call it? Nokia six. That's the Nokia six. It's Absolutely. Nokia 6. Yes. There's no eight or anything. No. It's very simple. It's very simple. Very, very clean. And then you have a. I can also show you, as the next one, the Nokia five. Let's find it in the right pocket. Yeah. You have a bunch. Yeah, I have You're a launching bunch. three Android phones this time, yes, right? Yes. That's that's right. Yes. Yeah. Do I have it? Do you have it? Oh, right. Yes, it's here. There it is. So let me let's compare the size. Oh yeah, let's let's compare the size. It's so that's actually, the five. It's actually a good idea. So you see, first of all, you see that um, the devices are following a, a very similar design philosophy. This one is also built out of a, a, a full a piece of uh, aluminium. Um, you see also here uh, that this one is a little bit more rounded. The display is. Switch both on. The display is a little bit, a little bit smaller. This one is 5.5 inch. This one is actually 5.5.2 uh, inch. The processor uh, are the same, and actually uh, the camera of this device is a 13 uh, megapixel, while this one here has a 16 megapixel. The front-facing camera is uh, identical for the two devices, with 8 megapixel uh, wide-angle and uh, out of focus. The displays both look very good, so it's like an IPS is good, uh, good quality stuff, right? Absolutely, absolutely. So it's a nice experience. Uh, the nicest experience you can get for how much is this one? So this one is going to uh, come to the market also in uh, Q2. Um, it's going to retail at around uh, 189 uh, euros. Whoa, that's cool. That's cool. But that's not all. Because lots actually, of companies are doing expensive stuff. This we actually, is we actually have one more. We have one more device, which is even more affordable than the uh, than the others. This one is the Nokia 3. So the Nokia just check, sorry, yes. that, uh, the brightness is yes, also let's, maximum. Let's tune it up. Thank you yeah. very much. So the Nokia 3 uh, is coming uh, also to the market at the second uh, quarter of this year. Maybe you can put this and in the pocket, it's, so it's, please. And uh, yeah. this. Sorry, second quarter? Second quarter, and this one is going to retail at 139 euros. 139? Yes. Uh, what's the resolution of this compared to that? So the uh, the resolution is, uh, first of all, this is a 5-inch uh, uh, display. Is it full HD? Uh, this one is full HD, this one is HD. And this one is HD as well. All right. 
So, so this one is powered by a MediaTek processor, these two are um, Qualcomm processors. Yeah. This is a quad core? Um, that I would um, actually yeah. check. Yeah, and this is These a ones are quad core for sure. Quad core, all right. Uh, there, so, so the, the memory, how about the batteries are good? Ma ma maybe the, the, the battery, uh, uh, the, um, um, the memory configuration on this one, uh, it's 2 gigabyte uh, of RAM and 16 gigabyte of uh, user memory. So one thing special about this product is yeah. actually uh, the camera. You know, a lot of uh, a lot of devices in this price point, the front-facing camera is not very good. So what people are doing is this when they take a selfie. So they actually yeah. use the main camera for taking a selfie. Then they have to shoot quite many to actually make it work. So it's not a problem in this device because the front camera and the main camera are identical. It's both 8 megapixel uh, autofocus uh, wide-angle lenses. About the battery, so shipping with the latest Android experience uh, also gives you some really good uh, um, uh, advantages. Um, for instance, you have features like Dose, um, Android Dose. So whenever you put the device into your pocket or you put it on the nightstand, it will, it will uh, realize that it's not in use and will shut down unnecessary uh, functionality so it will save battery and uh, basically last long. Batteries are from uh, 3,050 milliamperes from the uh, Nokia 6, so over 3,000 for the Nokia 5, and 2,650 uh, for uh, the Nokia 3. Nice, and there's a lot of people at your booth. Absolutely, absolutely. There's, there's uh, one phone which uh, was stealing a lot of the attention, which is uh, the 3310. Maybe we can just uh, have a quick walk over there. Yeah, I filmed and, a, I filmed uh, another video with that one. Yeah, so. and just look at, uh, at this device as well. But you see, yeah. uh, the stand is buzzing, and uh, people are really, really interested about taking it in their hands. So what's going to happen in the next two or three months? It's going to be very busy. So the next uh, two three months, we're going to be very busy polishing uh, the final everywhere? experience and, and getting uh, getting the Global. devices to the market globally, <laughs> globally. And uh, so there's US dollar prices for the US, or is mainly the Europe and not so the US? So we are communicating the Europe prices here because uh, the MWC is happening in uh, in uh, in Barcelona. So just recapping, it's 229 euros. It's uh, 100 uh, for the Nokia 6. It's 189 euros for the Nokia 5, and it's 139 euro for uh, the Nokia 3. There's one special edition of the Nokia 6 with a higher memory configuration which is retailing for 299 euros.